So I've been sitting here for like five minutes switching between all my colors and stuff that I have for like my background lighting. As much as I like this room and everything, the lighting in here is so garby. If anybody is like a lighting wizard or anything like that, I want to make my room a lot brighter with lights and shit so it doesn't seem so dark when I'm recording. All I want to do is just lighten up the background, all right? I have my ring light, another light over there, my ceiling light, and then that lamp. Before I get extremely sidetracked talking about random lighting and just dumb shit, what's going on guys? It's Premiere here. Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully you guys are all having a beautiful and wonderful day. And welcome back to another Call of Duty Modern Warfare video. So yeah, I'm not really sure what I want to do in Modern Warfare today. I'm just kind of bumming around, man. I haven't done a whole lot when it comes to this game. It's not the fact that there isn't anything to do in Modern Warfare. It's just the fact that there is a lot of things to do or a lot of things that I guess I could sit down and talk about. Sometimes, man, I just don't know how to make it entertaining. This is a little bit off topic, but didn't they add like a brand new like suppressor or something to the Uzi or something like that? All right, so they did. They ended up adding a brand new barrel for it. Was there any other weapon in this game that ended up getting like a secret attachment? I mean, this doesn't look like it's going to be all that crazy. So real quick, I just want to thank you guys so much for all the support as of recently. We are so close to a thousand subscribers. I think we're like, what, 21 subs off or 19 subs off, something like that. So if you guys are brand new to the channel and you enjoy the content, please consider subscribing. It always helps me out. If I can gain 19 subs in like three days before the end of the month actually happens, I would be just so fucking happy. I don't think I could even put into words of how happy I would be. I mean, hitting the subscribe button is free, all right? You don't have to pay anything for this. You can get all this content for 100% free, and all you have to do is just subscribe to the channel. It's why do I keep doing this motion with my arm? I don't know. These are questions for later. It's like I'm hitting the Rasengan or something like that. Anyway, all right, you know what? I'm going to try out this gunfight 3v3 snipers only just because I wonder if it's any good. I have a weird feeling that people that are playing in this playlist are going to be just sniping kids. I mean, this could end up being a video where all I do is get shit on by people that are sniping. If I end up getting just clapped all day long, my self-esteem is probably going to fall apart. All right, so we've got the MK2 right away. <laughs> Yeah, this is gonna be a tough one. I haven't slept on this game in a couple of days, so I'm probably just gonna get shit on. I kinda don't like this because it feels way more competitive, and I just feel like people don't really want to move. That's kind of half the reason why I've never really got into gunfight. Nice. Bro, I was straight nervous. I don't like shit like this. My room right now is so hot and I feel like I'm dying from anxiety. I love the fact that this shit is just a video game and yet I get kind of worked up about it. Just because I want to compete, all right? I want to be the fucking best in the lobby. But then I get into a gunfight lobby and I just get completely trashed. We're definitely going to try this out for a little bit. I'm going to try a couple more games of this, but I don't see myself fucking lasting for long without destroying something. All I know is if I lose this game, I'm going to fucking swing on myself. I will knock myself out. Like my left arm will become Brock Lesnar's left arm. I got really mad there. I can't stand when people swing on you when it's snipers only. Even back in like Black Ops 4, Modern Warfare Remastered, when they ended up adding those game modes. Like, listen, this shit ain't the UFC, all right? You don't gotta run on me and then try to leg sweep my ass and punch my lights out. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself because I feel like this shit's more torturous than playing with the actual dragon off. I just don't feel well equipped. I don't feel prepared. I feel like my sensei entered me into a contest and I just wasn't really ready for it yet. If we win this match, I'll play one more game. But if we lose, I'm out. I think the whole snipers only thing is actually pretty damn cool. I know there's a couple of people in the sniping community that really wants just snipers only. All right, so since we caught a dub right there, I'm gonna go play another game of this. As soon as I lose, I'm out. I'm just done. Like I said, it's kind of fun, but my fucking anxiety just can't handle this. I have no idea why I get so stressed out when I do this. It's like missing clips for me as well. I get like extremely stressed out and pissed off with myself. All right, yeah, this whole snipers only gunfight three, it's fucking garbage. I guarantee if you had a couple of friends that went and played with you on this and you had like an actual team with coordination and everything, it could be a good time. From the five games that I played, all I did was play against people that wanted to sit in their scope. I could just say that the whole sniping only thing isn't for me, all right? It's so weird after going into that playlist and then just going into a casual multiplayer game and being able to actually hit my shot. quad feed right there. All right, you know what? First game on for actually sniping in a regular lobby. We ended up dropping 72 kills. With the whole gunfight snipers only thing, it wasn't good for me only because it's just not fast paced. If they actually ended up adding a regular snipers only lobby where it's 6v6 or 5v5, I think a lot of people would enjoy that, especially if you could use your own classes and stuff. Just like in previous Call of Duties like Modern Warfare Remastered, Black Ops 4 and stuff like that. So anyway, yeah, over the past couple of days, I've started to play the Division 2 quite a bit. I know the Division 2 is like a year old or something like that at this point. When the Division 2 first came out, 
I ended up getting it on my PC. I'm pretty sure when I stopped playing it, I had my gear score at like level 450 or something like that. I think at that time, it was like the max gear rank that you could get. A bunch of my friends over on the Xbox ended up getting the division and there's no like cross play or anything like that. So I had to completely restart when I started to play again. But since I've started to play division two again, I basically allowed that game to take over my life because I'll end up coming home from work or school and I'll sit down and grind for like five hours, six hours straight. Sometime around like two o'clock last night where I looked at my clock and realized it was two o'clock and I haven't uploaded a video in two days. That's a problem with me when it comes to story mode games because I become so invested in the game and just try to grind through it all and get to the end game. So anyway, what kind of games do you guys play that you just get fully immersed in them where you could lose so much time? I know a couple of days ago they ended up adding that whole ground war infection game mode and I really want to play that but I guess they ended up taking it out for some reason because it was giving way too much XP. So yeah, once they end up adding ground war infection back into the game, I'll definitely make a video on that. After sniping for a couple of games, my shot is kind of there right now. Let's hop back into the sniper's only playlist. If I end up getting clapped, this koozie is going across my room, all right? I have to have a positive attitude while playing this and not be an idiot. All right, now we got it. Maybe I just needed a couple of games to warm up. We could have got the clutch if I wasn't so shit. I was so terrified that that one guy was gonna run up on me and swing on me like this is some Brock Lesnar shit. I don't know how many people have been around on my channel for a long time. If anybody even gets the references when I mention Brock Lesnar, please let me know down in the comment section. If you guys want some context about the whole entire Brock Lesnar thing. Looks like you lost another one. A game like this where these guys actually kind of moved around, that was fun. Anyway, a year ago, back when I was living in my old house, I used to have spiders all over the place. One day I was going to the bathroom and I noticed a little spider on the floor. This little wolf spider ended up charging at me, like dead ass sprinted at me with his eight little legs. I mean, I did what everybody would do in that situation. I screamed internally a little bit and then I killed his ass. Ever since that day, I ended up having these issues with spiders because I killed so many spiders in my bathroom. I had come to the conclusion that they were going to build a giant ass Brock Lesnar spider to come beat my ass for killing so many of them. Brock Lesnar's terrifying, all right? I guarantee he could kill my ass basically like Saitama. One punch that shit! If we were able to use our own custom classes, this game mode would be banging. But other than that, I don't really like the fact that every sniper that you get is extremely slow. But anyway, hopefully tomorrow they end up adding that whole ground war infection game mode back because I really want to play that. I really want to try that shit out. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like and subscribe if you guys feel like it. Hope the rest of your day is the absolute best of your day, guys. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Peace, peace, my flutter pie.